hurricanes, tropical storms, wildfires, or other disasters strike, wireless is a critical lifeline. That's why we invest to strengthen networks and restore service in even the toughest conditions. Specialists constantly monitor weather conditions from network operations centers, putting response teams on high alert and directing critical equipment to where it's needed most. When the storm comes, we take action, rolling out everything from network equipment to command and first aid trailers, sleeper trailers, and workshops on wheels. First responders are a priority. ECVs, emergency communications vehicles, and MCTs, mobile connectivity trailers, provide communications for federal, state, and local emergency operations centers. We can be up and running in as little as an hour. From there, you'll find us in the field, pulling all-nighters, doing whatever it takes to restore the network. The heart of our disaster response can be found in the barnyard. Colts sell on light truck, and cows sell on wheels. Provide an all-in-one mobile network with antenna, satellite backhaul, generator, and battery backup, all in one vehicle. We even have flying cows, providing airborne connectivity. Crows sell repeater on wheels, reinforce cell signals. And when power is out, we'll bring in the goats, generator on a trailer. While our crews are working hard in the field, we also focus on keeping communities connected when it matters most. So we may ship new wireless devices and portable batteries, set up mobile stations for charging and assistance, or make sure you can make calls, text, or use data without worrying about the fees. Our commitment doesn't end when the storm is over. We stay on the ground for as long as it takes to help people get back on their feet. From the Northeast to the Florida Keys, from the Great Plains to the Colorado Rockies, from the Desert Southwest to the Pacific Northwest. During a disaster, we have one priority, ensuring your family's safety through wireless connectivity.